As you can see, we have the actual sewing machine here, but it also comes with a whole bunch of accessories. So we've got a whole bunch of different bobbin threads. We've got a seam ripper. Um, we've got extra feet. We do almost always have a ukulele. Uh, again, that was one of the first items that we added to this collection back in 2015. Um, so at this point, um, since we've added new stuff, um, folks are more interested in exploring in exploring that. Our lawn equipment right now, super popular. <laughs> um, but this is what I was able to bring in, our very well-used um, hedge trimmer. So we have our button maker. These are heavy. Which comes with five, a set of five uh, buttons for button making. We want people to be able to try things out in a low risk environment. Having to put a lot of money up front or take any, you know, big personal risks or anything. My name is Molly Milazzo and I'm a youth services librarian here at the Arcade branch of Sacramento Public Library. We became more responsive to our communities, um, especially once we put the polls up. People were very vocal about wanting certain items, um, wanting to see certain kinds of collections. And so even within the library of things, um, like on our website, you can select certain categories like tools, electronics, um, lawn equipment, musical instruments. Um, and within those, we've seen some really interesting borrowing patterns. So it's informational for us, um, and it's great to be able to offer this to the community. Learning and discoverability. We want people to be able to borrow these, try them out, and if it's for them, great. Uh, and then they can invest further, buy their own if they would like. Arcade is located um, in the epicenter of refugee resettlement in this area. And so we've had a lot of folks um, from those communities come in and ask about these services. Of course, anyone is welcome to come to any of our libraries uh, to pick out an object and take it home and then bring it back. Um, that's part of why we started at one branch was to make it kind of a destination library um, and to get people, you know, two different libraries in the community because we serve the whole county and each one is pretty different. It's just one more way we contribute to the, the sharing economy um, that I suppose in many ways started with libraries um, and this is just another inter iteration of that. Yeah, we don't charge for, um, for 3D printing or for the library of things um, uh, unless it comes back late.